I'm Zelda Nitus, and, well, here we are. The final battle with Nasty Nork. I hope you guys enjoy this. So, yeah. I'm gonna be quiet now. Sorry I took so long. I kind of forgot about you. What about Ganasty Ganork? Nasty Nork? His toast! So now there's order again in the Dragon Kingdom? Well, mostly. I've still got some treasure to pick up. What will you do next? I'd say the sky's the limit. Okay. Now. We have one more thing that we must do. We're not done with the game yet. All of you know this. And you can tell by the video link, too. And most of you have already played this game, too. So, I'm gonna be quiet. I'm gonna let the credits roll. Because I'll be talking on the real, true credits. So, yeah. Enjoy.
Okay, so we have one more dragon to find. And here he is! Let's go and, you know, talk to him, shall we? I think we should. And then we beat the game! Magnus. Nasty's ancient history now. So, what's in there? I believe this is Nasty's treasure hoard. But the gate will not open until you have found everything in the Dragon Kingdom. Come back when you have reached 100%. Alright, and we did that just now, so... Yay! I'm gonna replay the dragon, because the mouth didn't open. Nasty's ancient history now. So, what's in there? I believe this is Nasty's treasure hoard. But the gate will not open until you have found everything in the dragon. I think I forgot something. Hang on. Okay, so I did forget something. Look at our treasure. 117... Well, 11,798%. Hmm. What are we missing here? Pay attention. We are missing a freaking speedway here in Magic Crafters. I will meet you at the speed. Move, bitch! Get out the way! I need to beat this game! Like, now! <laughs> Come on! This has got to be the last one. I mean, what else could there be? Okay, so, other than that, let's do this. Let's really do this. Alright. Now the rings first, the arches. Ah, oh, I'm gonna say this let's play took longer than expected. And Twilight Princess is kinda lagging, but mm, I kinda have a right because I'm in college. But then again, I've been on Skype more and playing with Kagero. I'm sorry guys. <laughs> but Kagero comes first. <laughs> and college. Oh, okay, so I don't go for the treasures yet, I go for the for the flyers because they lead me straight to the chests. So that's good. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! I saw a good turkey. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Alright, can I make it? Of course I can. This is easy! Alright, and after this, I will meet you at Nasty's Loot. Alright? Okay. Yay! We're all done! Woohoo! Yay! Uh, no, I don't want to try again. Alright, I'm going to meet you guys at Nasty's Loot. Okay. So, we're here at NASA's world, and finally it opened! Yay! Nasty Sloot! We're gonna kick some ass! Like, you know? Totally. Ugh, okay. Yes! Alright, now... Uh, now, the cool thing about this is you can fly whenever you want. Kind of like, you know, in the, in the flights. But, however, it is a little bit... Restricted, I should say. You can only fly at a minimum height for the time being. This place has 2,000 gems in total. I am not going to lie, it has 2,000 gems. So expect a lot of purples, a lot of yellow. I think, well, just purple and yellow. Nobody dare say black and yellow. That song is stupid. It is retarded, and I don't like it. So, there. And these purple thieves are assholes. I swear, I can't get them yet. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, get over here. I'm, uh, I'm gonna kill you. Thief, I need to kill you. Get over here. Oh! See how much of a pain in the ass they are? They're so... Uh, 
Get over here, please. Please let me kill you. <laughs> that thief really doesn't want to die. Oh, there you go again, you little bats. Kill you. There we go. What? Oh god. Something. She got sick, so I'm taking care of her for now. But she's a strong gal, so of course she'll still need me. And I, and I like that. Alright, come on. Can, can I make it? Like, uh, um, how do I get up again? How do I get up there? Oh, oh, right, right, right. The way you get up, the way you get higher is if you unlock all those, you know, things. Well, doors. Alright, so we're at 400. Yay! Alright, so next Let's Play is gonna be Resident Evil 1. And it is the one that I downloaded off the PSN store because I tried to find an original copy. I tried to find on Amazon. But, um, nothing. Well, I could, but it's over $100, and I'm not gonna pay $100 for a game. Especially one that, okay, yeah, it is new, and it is, you know, something that most people would buy because of the price, but I'd rather get it for 10 bucks. I'd rather get the director's cut for 10 bucks than pay 109 Oh, yeah, sure, it's a $100 Let's Play. <laughs> um, oh, funny. <laughs> Yeah, hey guys, guess what? I paid a hundred dollars for a Let's Play. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I hope the thief comes by here so I can kill it. Oh, no. Doesn't want to. Alright, where is it? Where are you, thief? I know you're here. There you are! When I was a kid, you see those little sparks coming out of it? I thought it was a bomb. The thieves... The thieves just, you know, have a bomb, or those planes are bombs, and the fuse is running out. So that's why they're flying to keep it away, because, you know, the thieves, they don't want to blow up. Or, you know, they want to keep flying. Well, that's what I always thought. <laughs> he has a fuse in his ass. <laughs> oh my gosh, me when I was a little girl. Such amazing things have happened. Oh yeah, one more thing I should mention. Nobody's still commenting in Resident Evil, in the Resident Evil series Let's Play. But, Cog it out. Nobody else. Only Cog. See ya! Only Cog, or Kagata the final boss, is allowed to co-commentate with me on Resident Evil. And also, there is a little surprise on Resident Evil 5 on who I'm going to be playing with on Resident Evil 5 or co oping Guess who it is? I'm pretty sure some of you guys can figure it out, though. <laughs> I know the person that I know the person that was chosen is really hyped up. Oh, also, I have beaten Resident Evil 5 before, all 100%, upgraded all the weapons all the way, but, however, I am going to be doing something different. S different, per se. I will not have infinite ammo on. I will only have... I will only have infinite ammo for a pistol. An un... Uh, low... Okay, here's the thing, basically. I will just buy a pistol because it's totally unupgraded and I will use that. Then the rest of my weapons? No infinite ammo. Because oh, I'm also... We're gonna be doing it on normal. Because hard? It's just hard. Easy? Way too easy. And, uh, yeah. Just wanted to make sure that about that. So yeah. Also in Lost Nightmares, of course that one's obviously 
a no-brainer. It's going to be using no infinite ammo whatsoever because it doesn't give you any infinite ammo. So yeah. I really hope I got that, by the way. Oh yeah, I did. Big Spiral's little airdrop thing. It's really awesome. Oh, another rocket. Another rocket! Oh god, Team Rocket blasting off at the speed of light. Oh my gosh. I think I can do the... Wait, no. No, never mind, never mind. It's been a long ass time since I ever rehearsed that. <laughs> you know, one of my friends, once a Pokemon anime came up, you know, on, as a cartoon, and I always watched it. My friend was Jesse, and I was... Well, no. My friend was James, and I was Jesse. So I actually dyed my hair red. <laughs> I had lots of fun. <laughs> Alright, the rest of the treasure is up here. And by the way, <laughs> I'm rich, bitch! <laughs> Look how much treasure comes out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm in the money zone. I'm rich, bitch! <laughs> okay, let's see if that's enough to please this thing. Alright, um, for 3, 2, 1, yes! Now, we beat the whole game. And now, let's just go ahead and go. Alright, I just want to say, I had really fun doing this Let's Play, and I had really fun having you guys watch. So, yeah. Uh, bye! Oh, my Spyro the Dragon! You've defeated Ganasty Ganork, collected the dragon eggs, saved all the dragons, and recovered every bit of treasure in the Dragon Kingdom. How do you feel? I feel fired up, Bob. And I'm happy for the Dragon World, of course. I certainly wouldn't want to spend the rest of my dragon days butting heads with Nasty Nork and his weird minions. What's a minion? Uh, never mind. You know what they say. For every good battle, you need a good adversary. And I felt that Nasty, in spite of his misguided nature, was a worthy opponent. Uh-oh. Here we go again! Ooh, what could have happened there? But anyways... Ah, yes, it is that time for me to cry over a game. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna cry. Okay, so let's, let's look at the real true credits. Ah. <sighs> ah. And what a let's play. What a great time we had. Ah. Alright, I really gotta continue Twilight Princess really, really soon because that let's play is just gonna be long and I will do like 40 minute let's plays of that game or episodes so while I'm recording I will I will you know be on for a while I think I'll probably just record two hours of footage and then you know sync up my voice sync up this and then upload it right away I decided to upload all my content at once or so that way you guys can, you know, have some time to look at my, you know, oh, still a couple, you know, look at my, look at my videos, and then, you know, have that to look at for a while. That way I can actually have time for myself, instead of just uploading it once a day. You know? Plus it makes things much easier for me, and plus I have a lot of Let's Plays planned, so, um, yeah, I kind of want to do that.
Oh yeah. Um, co-commentate with me. Plus, he actually helped me out in my little playthrough. Alright, so no sheep were harmed. Only a few norks, but no sheep. Even though we killed them and took their soul. Alright. Goodbye, everybody. I'm gonna miss you. And... Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna kill some sheep. I'm gonna get sparks up to poor health. I'm sorry, little sheepy sheep, but you had to die. Oh, and I'm gonna leave that. Wait, what the? That don't represent a Connor. Alright, well, this is where I say goodbye. <laughs>